Bitcoin, are you following the Bitcoin stuff? Here and there, yeah. I heard it's doing well. <laughs> Bitcoin, it's all about Bitcoin. Yeah. It's, uh, Bitcoin is mainstream, man. Uh, it's everybody is talking to me about Bitcoin yeah. just in my life, outside of the internet. Hmm. People are, the word has tremendous buzz. And you have, of course, governments are writing up all types of stimulus packages to combat the, the COVID effect on the economy in, in various world economies. And people are, well, people are doing what people do. They're looking at the stock market. They're looking at, they're looking at gold. They're looking everywhere, well, mm -hmm. in an effort to try to escape the potential inflation that could come along with these enormous stimulus packages. This is an economic show, by the way. Yeah. Yeah, I just want to remind you. Yeah. That's, that's the root of it. Bitcoin is one of those places. It's a, uh, futuristic and uh, limited and all the, you know, all the sales pitch that's been going on. It's just, it's perfect for right now. Yes. Bitcoin is just perfect for right now. And so we've seen the, the value skyrocketing. But I need to get an update from you because this, I'm on Reuters right now. Okay. And they're telling me that it fell sharply on Monday. Is this true? Nothing sharp about that. I mean, it is down. Uh, well, once it reached uh, 30,000 yeah. <laughs> for Bitcoin, it immediately jumped another it went right back 2, up. Yeah. And then it went down again. Yeah. According to <laughs> today. Yeah, today. So this yeah. this article was that see that sharp fall right there. That right there, it went below 30 grand from a high of like what? 34, 33, 33. Then it drops down to the high 20s. And now it starts to climb again as the day has gone on since I selected this particular article. So it does showcase a certain amount of volatility, which is still there. However, I mean, if you just, just please do me a favor and take that chart and put like a year on it. This is just, this is just out of control. Put a five year on it. This is just, look at the current spike. My God. So anyway, yeah, Bitcoin is super hot and it's becoming it's becoming impossible to predict what is well, maybe not impossible. I, I would say judging from that previous high, there there probably will be some correction coming sometime soon, but it seems actually surprisingly static. Uh-huh. Well, it, I mean like give me the give me the one give me the one year again. Give me the one year again on that. Like, yeah, we're super high right now. Okay, this chart's a bit deceiving. Because why is that 10 and the other one is 30? It's definitely this chart's a bit deceiving. But anyway, point point being is it's been above 10 grand for a while now. I guess for for, for people that are interested in investing, yeah, it's it's a huge cliff right now. That they're you're climbing a huge cliff. That chart is much better. Yeah. That chart is does a much better job of illustrating how much higher we are right now. It is such a bizarre psychology though for me cuz you it seems hard to buy right now. But yet it isn't for so many people. You would think mm -hmm. Look, there's obviously tremendous complexity here as to how people are trying to make money in this in, in any kind of trading whether it's currency, stocks or otherwise. But there is no doubt that there's tremendous hype around Bitcoin right now. And I expect it to, to, to give you the evidence. I expect it to make a story about how it was, how it was tumbling a little bit, which is the headline of my particular article. And no, then, no. And then in, it bounced back. in that amount of time between reading that and shooting this, it rebounded Within the other way again. An hour or two. Yeah, an hour or two. So it goes to show you how much action is happening around Bitcoin. It continues, man. But he's into Bitcoin. 